You're listening to The John and Heidi Show. Now, featuring the wit and wisdom of Dan Ferris. Okay, dudes, let's walk this sucker. On Sunny 93.3. It's The John and Heidi Show bonus hour with Dan Ferris. Dan, how you doing on this Wednesday? I'm okay. Okay, <laughs> but it's it's Wednesday. It's a good day to to be happy. Oh, it is a Wednesday. Yeah, because we don't always do Wednesday on Wednesday. I know. I well, usually it's when I forget. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be giving something away. Is what you're saying? Yeah, I'm gonna be giving away some tickets to some stuff here. We'll, oh, we'll tell, I'll tell you about that here in a minute. Amazing, Rick Ocasek, Cars fame, front man. For Love the him. Yeah, you know he changed his last name. Really, but not by much. Kind of interesting. His birth name, last name is Otkasek. All he did was drop oh. the T. That, that was a good Ot-Kasic. choice, yeah. I think. Interesting. Yeah, that, that is. I think it's very interesting, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yvette Marie Stevens is 69 today. You know her best is Shaka Khan. Shaka Khan. And Betty Nesmith Graham was Sorry. born this day in 1924. Not only did she invent liquid paper, why not? She was Mike Nesmith of the Monkeys' mom. Ah, oh. yep. See, I Very find cool. I find this all random so stuff. Her later brother, on. I love the whole whiteout thing. That her, to me is awesome. It is. Her brother's probably one that coined the phrase uh, "I'll be a monkey's uncle." <laughs> no idea what wow. you're talking about, John. But wow, it was 1775. Patrick Henry proclaims, "Give me liberty, or give me yeah. death." Yikes. Speech in favor of Virginia troops joining the U.S. Revolutionary War. 1857, love this story. Elijah Otis installs his very first elevator. Little building, 488 Broadway in New York City. Now estimated to move over 2 billion people a day with over 2 million customer units worldwide. That's crazy. Otis Elevator Company employs approximately 70,000 people. Woo! And uh, when I last I took a peek, that company was uh, trading on the down at around $75 a share. So Okay. What a, what a fantastic story. It really is. Yeah, going strong. And 2016, finally, investigation... <laughs> This is just sad. This is day 2016. Official investigation of William Shakespeare's tomb at Holy Trinity Church, Stratford, England. Concludes, uh, the bard's uh, skull has been stolen. What? Why would somebody steal his skull? <laughs> That's a good Oh, question. give me a minute, John. I'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> is it a Hamlet thing? Is that what's going on here? There's somebody running around That's somewhere yeah. with, with Shakespeare's gourd. Yeah. But the, Maybe they drink wine out of it. Nowadays, I wonder if people even realize that that's what that is. Like, whoever has it knows. It's like a keychain. Oh, whoever has it absolutely yeah. knows. <laughs> Shakespeare's head. Huh. Unless a dog just happened to snag onto it and ran off with <laughs> well, it. We don't know where too. it's at. Who yeah. knows? Yeah, it could it's be. hard to say. The guy's been ditched a long time. <laughs> he has been. All right. Well, I know. You know. Well, most of it anyway. Yeah. We all know. We just move forward here. We'll do that. It is the John and Heidi Show bonus hour with Dan Ferris. The Vegas Travel Center is offering three days and two nights accommodations to Vegas. They'll completely waive the package price. Plus, you get tickets to your choice of activities as well as meals. Jump on this now. Obviously, a deal like this isn't going to last. When they're gone, they're gone. So don't miss out. Just call 605-210-5220, and they'll get you set up for a great getaway. Call now for this special radio offer, 605-210-5220. That's 605-210-5220. Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic. We've got Dr. Harley joining us. How are you doing, Dr. Harley? I'm doing great. It's so nice out. I, I know. Mean, it's officially yeah. spring now. Oh. I think we talk about the weather every time. I think we talked about this last time. But, but you know, I think that's just the way it is. In the Midwest, so nice. we, if, if, the weather, if it's raining, I was like, hey, how about that rain? If it's snowing, how about that snow? If it's not, we're like, hey, is it supposed to rain or snow? <laughs> right. <Yeah. laughs> but uh, one of the things that we're going to chat about this week is pregnancy and when people are pregnant, if they can still come to a chiropractor. Because apparently you've had that question and the answer is yes. And you have people that are coming here, right? Yeah, of course. You know, I get that question a lot, but we see uh, moms, you know, before they're even pregnant to help with like their everyday problems that they're dealing with. Some may be even trying to get pregnant because we can help, you know, we're just making sure that everything's working properly and the nerves are functioning to help with that. But then also, yeah, during their pregnancy, not just at 36 weeks, but all the way through, 
you know, we help moms with the number one complaint of low back pain during pregnancy. Because obviously as baby's getting bigger, yeah. that's putting a lot of pressure on their hips and their low back. So they're going to have to deal with a lot of that. Sciatica is very common during pregnancy. And it's like a shifting of weight and a gaining of weight. And I've been through that, but I'm not pregnant, but I'm, I'm just a fat guy. Yeah. So, but but you can you can help people when they're going through that transition to make it so it's not as painful. Yeah, definitely. Um, you obviously, some are like, oh, how do we lay on our bellies? You know, there are specialized tables at some chiropractic offices, but we have um, some specialized pillows that basically just take the pressure off the belly so they're able to lay face down. Moms love it because they don't usually get to lay face down during their pregnancy, right? So it's just, you know, one, it's a comfort thing for them. And two, we're just helping make sure that their hips are moving well, you know, moving, making sure there's room for baby. And especially as we get closer to delivery, that's really important because you start getting that relaxing hormone getting in there and making all those joints very loose and mobile. So it's very easy for the hips actually to get stuck and not move. Well, if the hips aren't moving very well, there's not going to be enough room for a baby to move into that optimal head down position for labor. So that's where, you know, we see babies are breached or they're transverse. And then we're looking at, you know, having to have some uh, surgical prevention to help, you know, with mom and baby. Now, I'm not saying chiropractors flip babies. We don't do that. But we make sure that their hips are moving properly. So baby has that room to move into that optimal birth position. So, you know, we do help moms with making sure they're getting ready for labor and just having a healthier, happier delivery. That is awesome. Now, you don't do the actual birthing here, right? No, no, <laughs> not at all. I just want to make sure. I kind of thought you probably did. <laughs> but, but when they're done with that process, uh, mom and baby can both come in and see you because that's probably a really good time for both of them to see a chiropractor. Oh, definitely. You know, birth is hard on mom, right? It's very hard, but it's also very hard on those little babies. And they can't tell you they're in a lot of pain or they're having problems, but they'll you know scream and cry and they're colicky and they're not sleeping at night. So a lot of times at uh, birth, especially C-sections, can be graded as like a uh, grade two whiplash injury. Like we don't realize how much force is put on a baby's head. A normal birth, you know, vaginal is like 50 pounds. A C-section can be up to 90 pounds of force applied to their little heads. And what's the first thing they tell you to do when to hold a baby? Support their head, right? Yeah, absolutely. So it's amazing that, you know, babies go through this process and they come out the way they do, right? They're perfectly healthy, normal babies. But yeah, we see a lot of both mom and babies a couple days, a couple weeks after birth to make sure that they're getting life off on the right foot and just helping them grow. Now, whether you're having a baby or not, if you'd like to find a chiropractor and see if Balanced Life Chiropractic is right for you, what is the best way for them to connect with you? Yeah, they can shoot us a message on our Facebook page, Balanced Life Chiropractic, or give us a call at 605-215-1785, and we'd love to let them know how we can help. Very nice. You can also find them online. Their website is Balanced Life. SD.com. It's Bernie Carrick, former New York City Police Commissioner. If you own a gun, you need to check out StopBoxUSA.com, the safest solution to keep a firearm in your home and get instant, reliable access to that gun. It's an awesome weapon retention product, especially if you have little kids at home or frequent visitors. Get access to your gun in under a second. StopBox is the safest solution to keep a firearm in your home. Use discount code RADIO to save 10% at StopBoxUSA.com. You need to check Check out StopBoxUSA.com. And now Stuff Dan Finds Interesting. It is time for Stuff Dan Finds Interesting on this Wednesday. Before we do that, can we give away a prize, Dan? Let's that's, that's do what, it. That's what Wednesday is all about. I know, except for I've been forgetting the last couple of Wednesdays to do this. Well, so. when we're sitting on, on a pile of prizes, it's easy yeah. to just take it for granted. And it is. It is. Well, I've got, uh, here's here's the tickets that we're giving away today. We're going to be giving away a pair of tickets to see Brad Wenzel, stand-up comedian. He'll be at uh, Spellbound Magic Shop this Sunday doing a, a, not a magic show, but a comedy show. Uh, he's been on the Conan O'Brien show. He's actually a very, very funny guy. I've seen uh, clips of him online. I've never seen him in person, but maybe I'll see him this Sunday. And uh, should I announce who the winner is? Let's do it. Do I need a drum roll or I just no. say it? No. And the winner is... Leanne Batiz. Woo! Congratulations, Leanne. <laughs> She's the winner of those tickets. And uh, by the way, if you'd like to register for next Wednesday, next Wednesday we're giving away tickets to see Hairball. They are going to be in Brookings. So I just want to make sure you understand the Hairball show in Brookings, and it's like two weeks from now or next week. It's the, the first weekend in April. So 
All whenever right. that is. There we I go. can't keep track. Yeah, so it's next weekend. But uh, if you'd like to win, sunnyradio.com. Click the little button that says win tickets and other cool stuff. And Dan, what do you find interesting today on this Wednesday? You know, I love when, when companies dig into stuff that, that I would never think to research at all. Yeah. Not even cross your mind, or most people's for that matter, but you come across and you go, Huh, that's kind of interesting. Yeah. According to Insurify, okay. they do nationwide stuff, check out vehicle data, all that kind of thing. They say in the past couple of years, approximately 1.8% of all car owners have gotten a drunken driving violation. Wow. Okay. That's a, that's a lot of people. But this is where it gets interesting. They broke it down to the top 10 vehicles that these people oh, drive. No way. Oh, so it was getting late at night, and you see one of these headed your way? Yeah, just, out of the way. Just get out of the way. Yeah. Get some room. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and I'm, I'm going, what, are you serious? You can break it down like that? Well, yeah, you can. It's yeah, all I on, suppose you can. Suppose. It's, all on, uh, it's all on record. Without further ado, here we go. The disgraceful top 10 of DUI folks. The Ford Contour is at okay. number 10. Dodge Dakota, no surprise. Yeah. GMC Sierra. I am a former owner of a GMC Sierra. Huh. Chevrolet Silverado at number seven. Okay. Toyota Tacoma at six. GMC Sonoma at five. Are a lot of these trucks? Seven of them are pickup trucks. I was say. <laughs> seven out of ten are so, pickups. So here's the if you see a truck coming at night, just get out of the truck's way. But this kind of messes the curve. The Audi A4 Ooh. is oh. at number four. Huh. With almost uh, with almost three point three percent of oh. of Dewey's drunk Whoa. driving violations. Really? Yeah, yeah. Then we have the uh, Chevy S Series trucks okay. at number three, the Subaru WRX. And this does not surprise me at all. At number one, with almost 5% of the drunk driving violations, the Dakota Ram 2500. Uh, yeah. So they, they drive that and they can ram into things while they're drunk, is what you're saying. No, huh. no. I just. Interesting. Uh, you, know, you meet a lot of Dodge Ram owners and you just go. <laughs> yeah, whatever dude whatever dude if you see any of those vehicles late at night just get out of their way is what you're saying yeah i just thought that was really interesting i can see and it makes way. perfect sense yeah i agree I right. think it's very well, interesting. there you go you aren't going to hear this kind of stuff anywhere else <laughs> no, i appreciate it dan thank you you got it. it is the john and heidi show bonus hour with dan ferris at bettercreditcards.com our mission is to help you get a better credit card why pay more interest than you need to we have cards with amazing points and perks if you're not a point person and just want the lowest interest rate you can find those too at bettercreditcards.com you can also find credit cards designed to help you build your credit bettercreditcards.com wants to help you get a better credit card give yourself a little credit at bettercreditcards.com that's better credit cards.com here's your market beat minute for wednesday march 23rd 2022 equities extended their rally tuesday with the s&p 500 gaining more than 1.25 percent at the high of the day and moving above the 4500 level for the first time in over a month the move is being met with growing pessimism however due to a rising expectations for the s&p 500 earnings targets to be lowered not only is there an impact from russian sanctions to worry about but rising oil prices and inflation are playing a role as well while an economic acceleration is expected in the second half of the year it seems as if 2022's darkest days may still be ahead. Trading on Wednesday will be impacted by Fed speak. Three FOMC members, including Chief Jerome Powell, are slated to make remarks before a variety of organizations. While no policy talk is expected, the market is sure to hang on every word. After Powell's comments Monday, the CME's FedWatch tool is now pricing in a 50 basis point hike at the next meeting as greater than 60%, and that figure is likely to rise over the next month. You can get the inside track in your inbox at marketbeatminute.com.